he is well prepared for this contest. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Both fighters are 31. Pettis is three inches taller. The reach is identical. And now one more time for the official introductions. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Steve Levin. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, This man is a Taekwondo fighter, holding a professional record of 21 wins, 8 losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin, USA, presenting the challenger, Anthony Chopin! This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC lightweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready? Ready? All right, here we go. UFC lightweight title is on the line. This is again with a right punch. Nice punch. Here's the kick blocked by Lee. Pettis gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. <laughs> nice kick. Big power in that kick. This is a this is a bit of a chess battle here. Look how light he is on his feet, too. Oh, big kick! Oh, very nice. Oh! And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You got to get that head off the center line. Such good movement in there. Nice. Good straight left. Oh! Oh! Wow. He's trying to stay up. The champ is in big trouble. He's in deep danger right now. Who saw this coming? And now starting to snap off that jab. Tries a flying knee. Straight punch. And he's looking for that left. Effective punch there by Lee. Beautiful right leg kick there. Caught him with a punch. How about that chin? Let's get that and win the round. Joe, pretty well played there to avoid the clinch. Head kick lands. 
45 seconds remain in the round. Just missed with the straight left hand. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Nice front kick to the body. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. Final seconds of round one. Hard jab. What a fight so far. Beautiful strike here, lands on target. And there's a kick to the body. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. Big round. Man, that was beautiful, man. He's hurt. You had him right there, man. You could have closed this off. You're gonna do it on this round. Brittany Palmer in the building. Ready? Ready? Second round underway. At the end of that round, his opponent was clearly hurt. He's going to look to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. Anthony Pettis is one of the best kickers in mixed martial arts today. He has excellent hands as well, but what really shines from Anthony Pettis is his kicking. He also has a very highly underrated submission game. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. Can we show you the total strikes? Oh, nice. with the left hook. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Oh, he found the target there, Joe. Nice punch. That one hurt. Caught the kick there, Joe. Nice hook by Lee. Back to the left hand now, but unable to connect, Joe. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. I like the way he mixed that up here. Oh, he got tagged! He got tagged! He's got him hurt here. Nice leg kick. Good kick. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. And he connects with the punch there. Looking to land the right just out of range. Oh! This could be it. The oh. kick lands. He's stunned. Here. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. He's putting his hands down on the thighs. He's looking to pass. 20 seconds left. Switching stances here. Nice shot. Well, Pettis' lower jaw now, Joe, started to show some signs of swelling. Oh, and he lands another punch. Sure. And round three coming up next. What a round it was. Maybe a round of the year candidate. Knockdowns on both sides. You don't see that every day. Here's a perfectly placed kick that results in a knockdown. Perfectly placed strike here. Lands on target. Big round. Listen, that was awesome. I need more of that. I want you to go out at the beginning of this round and be aggressive. Be smart. 
and Ariane Celeste doing work as usual. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Excellent feint with the kick. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Pettis gets hit by that kick to the body. Oh! oh. Devastating left hook! This could be it right here. Both guys landing big shots. Body kick, look at that. Wow! And just like that, the fight is over. Straight punch for the win. Yeah, Joe, just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. We can see it one more time. Look at this huge straight punch that causes the KO here. Here we see it again. Bang. And there is the UFC lightweight champion. He is going to be a hard guy to buck off the throne, getting it done by way of knockout here tonight. What a finish on the sport's biggest stage. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest. At one minute, 18 seconds of round number three. To play the winner by knockout and new UFC lightweight champion of Well, he's been talking about those two words throughout fight week and new UFC champion. He completes the mission here tonight, and you can see the emotion spilling over. Absolutely incredible what this fighter was able to accomplish, and it is going to take a special performance 